Hey folks, Big Dub here at Dragon Con. And I just got to my hotel room. I'm gonna show you the room, show you the view I have before things start to get crazy. So I wanted to kick the video off here. This video is not necessarily gonna be a hunt or a haul. It's just gonna be to show you the experience of Dragon Con itself because it's a convention unlike any other I've ever been to and I think you will enjoy it. So this is the beginning of the video. I will have a separate kind of hunt video of the shopping area. So you can check that one out too, but this will just be an all encompassing video of what it's like to be at Dragon Con, kind of like I did for Toy Lanta. So I hope you enjoy it. Let me show you around the room. So we're in the Westin at Peachtree Center. Come in, you've got a pretty nice bathroom with the shower. Not bad. Don't mind my luggage if you see it. We got a closet, pretty normal. But then the room is a nice big open space. Nice bed, desk, dresser, bench, plenty of space, plenty of room in here. Nice chair, and then a great view of the city. Uh, I think this is facing back toward the airport. Uh, you can see Mercedes-Benz Stadium over there. And then these buildings, these twin buildings are what I actually have a painting of in my house, original art, with a dragon sitting on top of them looking down at Dragon Con. So it's really cool to have a, a view of those buildings. So very cool view. We won't be in the room a ton, but this room won't look this clean any other time. So I wanted to show it to you. So there it is. We'll see you soon with more Dragon Con. Just giving you a look what the city looks like at night here. Still Wednesday night. We'll be calling it a night soon. We're just relaxing, getting ready for the calm before the storm. There you can see Falcon Stadium's lit up red. But that's the city as it's going to bed tonight. The next time you see me, it will be Thursday morning at Dragon Con, and we will start to go and get into the mischief. What's up, friends? It's Thursday morning at Dragon Con. Got a Red Bull, and I think Damien and I are going to go to the College Football Hall of Fame this morning while we wait for registration to open and uh, hang out downtown a little bit and then come back and uh, start to get wild. So I will show you just a little bit of footage from the Hall of Fame, and as we walk around, I know that's uh, not what you're here for, but I'll give you a little flavor for it in your ear, Craig Mack remix. You know what I'm talking about. And then we'll check out the rest of the convention shortly. Holla! Welcome back to ESPN's College Game Day built by the Home Depot. It's that moment, Des, that we've all been waiting for. And here to pick the winner of the biggest game of the day is our special guest. That's right, Reese. I'm Big Dub. We got a great matchup here today at Beaver Stadium with Penn State Nittany Lions facing off against the evil Michigan State. It is a great matchup, and it could come down to the wire. So who do you think is going to win? <laughs> hey, how about that? There you have it. 
That's just about all the time we have for this edition. We thank our special guest for picking the winner. And everybody, enjoy. We are back from the Hall of Fame in the lobby of the Weston. There are some folks, people checking in, waiting on a buddy to get here, and then it is off to badge registration and various other things. So, a little pause in the action. Touch it. A badge is acquired, pizza acquired. It's time to go to Dragon Con. Let's do it. Squeeze it! friends leaving the Hyatt Regency uh, I had to play music I'm sure over a lot of those clips because almost everything has music here and I don't want to get copyrighted but hopefully that gave you a feel of what Thursday at Dragon Con was like we didn't get the wrestling but we got a whole lot of craziness so try to capture that for you the next time you see me it'll be Friday morning and the convention will start properly so, hope you enjoy. I'll see you on the flip side. Hey, walking it. You get to use it oh, right. It is Friday morning. We found the den of debauchery last night. And now we are going to go get a little bit of breakfast and go to the shopping and the artist alley to start the day before we go to some panels. So, got to get going, got to get a Red Bull, got to get a little energy. And let me show you what the shopping is. I won't have a ton of the shopping because I'm going to make a separate hunt video for that. So look out for that. But I will give you a taste for it. So let's go check it out.
All right, we're walking out of the shopping. Gonna go check out what the rest of the convention has. So I hope you enjoyed a little look at all the shopping, but for now, let's go see what else we can find. Get in trouble. So, got a little food, went to a panel, back in the shopping, and looking at lightsabers. You wanna see? over there you see all the gaming I'm not even sure what all I've shown you at this point but hopefully you're getting a feel for the things I've done today walking back to the room I made another purchase I'm gonna drop it off probably we're gonna rest for a little while and then we're gonna go get into mischief tonight so I just wanted to touch base with you and see if you're enjoying yourselves I hope you are I'm not really sure what I'm showing you but Hopefully it's fun. See you in a bit. I think I'm gonna call it a day. We're in a blizzard, video game, family feud. I don't know what's happening. But, oh, player's backpack. Hey, squeeze it. We're gonna go to bed. Medical shipments. We're gonna go to bed, and we will see you tomorrow morning for the parade. Hopefully you're enjoying the video. I have no idea what nonsense is going on, but trying to take you with me. See you in a bit. Touch it. You get to use it All right. Well, we're going to the parade. It's Saturday morning. We're tired. Still a few more days to go. Three, including today. But uh, parade is about to start. It will be crazy as always. There'll be a whole lot of people there. Today is the college football kickoff game. Auburn and Washington right around the corner. So this is the day that Atlanta is the craziest all year long. So you're going to see quite a lot today. I hope you enjoy birthday in it.
Well, you saw a little bit of the parade. It's chaos. It's hard to get close. I tried to take some decent footage and get a few time lapses, so hopefully you saw that. Uh, we're gonna walk over and look at some things in the shopping and uh, while everyone's at the parade and see if we can get some uh, bargains. Touch it. down and kind of just like go into yeah. it they like my commission so it's probably very loud and you can't hear me but over my shoulder there is a commission I'm having done and it is just outstanding work I've shown you a little bit around his booth already but let me see if I can walk and show you a little bit in the background Here's his information, CJ Drayden. And he paints on glass. See some of his work over my shoulder, but that is the commission he is working on for me. Probably have already shown you some video of it, but I am very, very excited to get that. So just wanted to show you that's the type of thing you can have done at Dragon Con. Exciting. We're outside, headed to the Hyatt. Gonna check out the art auction and show. I hear a droid, there's R2. So uh, I don't think I can bring the camera in there, but that's where we're headed, to the art show. So we're going back to the hotel to take a break. One of my commissions is ready, but it is impossible to get into the shopping and art area right now. The, uh, the, the art hall, not the art show. Because it's Saturday, the busiest day of the con. So we're going to go take a break and then get into some mischief later tonight. Hope you're enjoying it. Touch it. I'm going to try to give myself a little pep in a step. Bullin' it. Emptying it. Hello, Weston. Hello. So we're going back to the shopping. It's kind of what we do. Go to the shopping. Uh, I have a commission that's ready to be picked up. We tried to do it earlier. It was chaos. Closes in like 30 minutes. So we're going to see if it's less chaos now. Because I'd like to go ahead and have it picked up and secured. And I don't know what else. That tape that goes for several blocks in each direction was the tape that you had to follow in line to come in here earlier. Madness.
Saturday of Dragon Con, folks. Craziest day there is. I don't know what all I've shown you, but I hope you enjoyed it. We did a little bit of everything today and tonight. Headed to bed. Talk to you in the morning. You can excuse if you like. All right. All right. It is Sunday, Dragon Con. We slept in a little bit. I uh, had to go retrieve our vehicles from the hiding spot and put them at the hotel uh, so that when we leave tomorrow, we'll have our vehicles here and can pack them with the various things. King size hot dog, about to do that. Then go check on how the commissions are going and uh, start the day. So pretty tired. We were up to about 4 a.m. And so we're tired, but it's been a good trip so far. Let's go see what the convention has for us today. Been a ton of footage today we went to the shopping I picked up another commission um, at the end of this I'll show you some of the stuff I picked up but I am now going to uh, get ready for the needcoffee.com fun fest you should check out needcoffee.com they put on a great show here at Dragon Con each year those are my friends and we're gonna get wild on it tonight so uh, I'm going to the Hyatt for that and who knows what else will be in store so you've seen a lot I am sure on this video so far um, Again, I'm not editing it. I'm just filming it as we go, and then I'll edit it later. So I don't know what I'm showing you. But today, there was a lot of lines, shopping, saw some cool stuff. Time to go. Hold on your butts. Six a.m. Back at the room. It's time for bed. Tomorrow's final day of Dragon Con. I'll give you a little bit more when I get home. I'll do a wrap up. It's been a great time with friends. Craziness. It's time for sleep. Back to back. Four a.m. or later is going to be tough. Squeeze. We decided to come back out for this. It's lit. Oh. Yeah, you're going to get it. I want to freak in the morning, freak in the evening. I want to freak in the morning, freak in the evening. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, this is what the Marriott looks like at 5 a.m. But there's still a good amount of people in the rave. We gonna finally go to bed this time. I think false alarm last time. This time I hope it's real. Holla, y'all. Oh, right. Well, you saw an unexpected rave that we decided to go to. We are tired. It is noon or so. Let's go pick up our commissions before the art closes. Maybe do some final shopping. One last look around and then we'll call it a day. Uh, I will close this video out. Next time you see my face, we'll probably be at my house talking about what we did, showing you what we got. So let's look at the final day of Dragon Con Monday. Usually very light. Most people have gone home, uh, but there's still a little bit to see. So let's check it out. All right, friends, back home from Dragon Con, finally. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really don't know when I edit it what it's gonna look like by the time you're listening to me talk. Uh, hopefully it's good. Uh, I'm sure it's gonna capture the experience. I'll try to leave sound in when I can. There's gonna be times I just can't because I'll get copyrighted. There's a lot of live um, copyrighted music going on at Dragon Con. Anyway, I wanted to take you for the experience, see how hectic it was, see how much fun we had. Uh, I will post two videos. I'm going to video that's more like a hunt, one of my traditional videos for the shopping where you'll see a lot of hunt footage. This one, you've probably seen a lot of all kinds of footage. Uh, so if you want to see all the things I bought in terms of figures, hot toys, that kind of stuff, check out my other, my hunt video, which I'll post in a couple days. Uh, but I do want to show you the original art I commissioned. So let's look at that. All right, so we'll start up here. These are two pieces I got Dan Doherty to make for me. First, we've got the Winnie the Pooh as Thor with Tigger as Groot and Piglet as Rocket Raccoon. The big scene in Infinity War where Thor lands says, bring me Thanos. We've got bring me honey. And then we've got Poonos up here. We've got the Iron Tigger. We've got Iyala. We've got Dr. Rabbit. And we've got Pax the Pig. And you can see Punos has snapped his fingers and they're dissipating into honey. I love Dan's artwork. I have a bunch of his art in my house. A couple more commissions to add. Then this is CJ Drayden. He was new at Dragon Con this year. He goes to other Comic Cons, big shows. He's headed to New York shortly. This is, is the, uh, the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And his interpretation, I love this. It is two panes of glass that are layered in like a shadow box. It's got supreme depth. I love it. And then this was my big commission this year. Again by CJ. You've got the Eye of Sauron on the tower. This is Drogon from Game of Thrones with Daenerys riding in to assault Sauron. And then up here in this bolt of lightning that is Thor. You can see his cape. You can see his hammer charging to attack as well. I think this piece is brilliant. It just turned out wonderful. It's a mashup of three of my absolute favorite things. And I think it turned out lovely. So those are the four pieces of original art that I commissioned at Dragon Con this year. So I'll close it out. I really do hope you enjoyed uh, this trip to Dragon Con. I had a good time. More out. I'm going to go try to get some rest. But if you enjoy this video, let me know. Um, I go to all kinds of places, as you know. I travel everywhere, so I try to give you a flavor for what it's like for those that can't make it. Uh, if you're interested in going to DragCon, you should come. It's a big convention. It can be intimidating, but I'd be happy to talk to you about it. Anyway, uh, like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with your friends. Leave a comment below. And I'll see you in the next video. Holla!
find the llama? Yes, you should find the llama. What happens if we find the llama? Squeeze it? You can squeeze it if you like. Oh, right.